Hello recruits and welcome back to Killing My Friends Long War of the Chosen. Today we are destroying an alien transmitter relay underneath Perth. Let's get started. Menace 1 5. The communications relay is up ahead. Move in and destroy the target. You speak truth. Alright, we got Chicken Boo, we got Overseer, we got Wizical, Robin, and Vitriol, who are our uh, rookies. Once again, we're starting in a corner, nice and neat. We're probably gonna see our first group of enemies somewhere over here. Orders confirmed. Moving out. Okay. And yes, Wizical, as I promised, this is indeed Bob Ross's voice on your character. Now let's get crazy. I'm all over it. We got Ivory Robin in the house. Move. It's a little bit risky, but that should be fine. And of course, Chicken Boo. What is wrong with you? Our path shall be won. You don't act like the other chickens do. You wear a disguise to look like human guys, but you're not a man, you're a chicken boo. Move into designated position. Please tell me I'm not the only one who remembers that. Animaniacs. A plus cartoon when I was a kid. Moving to designated coordinates. Still a little bit nervous about something coming out from up here, although there's less room now. So it should be fine. Moving out. Time to motor. What's your price for flight? We're ready. We are ready. There's something out there. Okay, it looks like they're more or less directly above me. Oh, wait. Oh, wow. They are close. This is actually pretty ideal, except for the fact that they they've see me. But I do get one Overwatch shot. Wizical only able to do one damage though. We must eliminate this enemy. Big no. Okay, we should be all right. Not a big fan of of those two Overwatches. We'll start by getting rid of one of them by bombing this sectoid. For five damage, Wizical, not bad. Not bad at all. Now we gotta deal with this guy. 71% on a straight shot. Marty, go ahead and finish off that sectoid. Target down. And with your second shot, let's see if you can take out this trooper. Target eliminated. What a legend. Overseer Marty doing the work. Now we just got to get this last one. I can get a flank here, but it's risky. Yeah, I don't want to end up activating another group if I can avoid it. Prevail. Yeah, I'm not going to risk it. I think instead I'm just going to bomb him. Catch. Vitriol for two damage. 
But more importantly, took out the cover so that Chicken Boo could finish the job. Not bad. Not bad at all. Pretty good first engagement. Absolutely. Got it covered. Heading out. Another Illyrium core, not bad at Target all. Package secured. And we're gonna approach kind of cautiously. We got nine turns until we have to get this thing destroyed. Okay. So we've got a little bit of time, but we don't want to like be wasteful with it. Not a problem. Got it. Our path is <laughs> XCOM soldiers love jumping through windows. It's just part of the gig. Overwatch. Come get some. Hold this point. We got advent here. I see two distinct groups. Get a little bit of Overwatch fire. Ivory Robin misses the 57%. Okay, a little unfortunate, but not a big deal. There we go. So long as we don't activate the other group that's in here, we should be fine. Just let it bounce right along. One damage on a grenade. Whizzical, you gotta do better. Gotta do better. Thirty-nine percent, absolutely awful. Vanquish. Nice. So we definitely don't want to get set on fire here. On my way. No, oh, there we go. Okay, I thought there wasn't a shot, but there is. Here we go. Grenade! Still not a kill, but it did take out the cover, so I should be able to get a nice flanking shot with vitriol here. 79%. Hostile neutralized. The graze for one is all I needed. Sectoid's gonna make a zombie, but I don't think he noticed me. So I think we are free to take this thing down without too much of an issue. Reloaded. This duty is mine. Whizzical misses on an 81%. Time the mine goes. Triumph through sacrifice. Chicken Boo finishes it off. Moving to position. Really, Marty? Right Did you here. have to bust through two windows? Was that absolutely necessary? I'm going to flashbang both of them. Blinded him! And we're going to get Robin all the way out here in the hopes of getting a good shot next turn. Maybe even come around over here. 
Running. We're close. Okay. I know that it is a seven to nine map. So this is everybody. That was close. I think I need some help. Oh, not great. Okay, Marty is in a bit of trouble here. They're on the move. Robin gets stunned. Don't move, you'll be all right. So we're gonna have Marty heal himself really quick. But he'll still be out for a little while, unfortunately. It is destined. Nice shot for one. God bless. Wizical finishes the job. Vitriol's the only one left, so we're gonna go ahead and make sure that this guy stays disoriented. Flash out. No good. Poor Marty. He's going to be out for a while after this. Do that, then. Vanquish. On your order. And the first use of the sawed-off shotgun. X-ray neutralized. No problem. And I believe that's it, but we still have to destroy the thing. There we go. So we're gonna we're gonna start up on that. It's got 20 health, should not be a problem. We're gonna go ahead and set up our extraction point. Requesting evac. This is Firebrand. Evac request confirmed. Hold tight. Moving to position. The ammo's running low. Marty picks up a suppressor. Asset secure. I'm on it. And also an advanced stock, which is exactly what we need. I have the asset. Now we do have Ready reinforcements coming in. So we're going to have to balance like between tree. doing damage to the thing and doing some overwatch. Sure thing. In fact, I'm pretty sure... I can Order just go on Overwatch and I'll still be okay. Be on, your guard. on Overwatch. Moving to Overwatch. Oh no, they're coming down way, way away from us. The alien transmission is still active and we're running out of time. Get to the relay and take it out ASAP. Working on it, Central. Heading out. Take a couple of pictures for posterity. That's affirmative. I'm all out. Our path is clear. Man 
Atlantis 15, we've confirmed destruction of the relay. The alien transmission is down. Eliminate any remaining hostiles and move to evac. Looks like the enemy doesn't know where I am. Let's go right up here and take a look. So I'm just gonna go On ahead, get close to my location. evac zone, and just do as much Overwatch as I can, just to be absolutely sure. Let's do this. What is this? An enemy has vanished. Hell yeah, Chicken Boo and Marty taking down the patrol as it comes in. Son of a gun of a mountain. A little bit of damage from Robin. Not much of a hit. But so long as he doesn't go Overwatch, we are out of here. Do I have a grenade somewhere? I don't think I actually get XP for this, but I may as well take the shots. What is that, four or five kills for Marty this, uh, this mission? Not bad at all. Until we meet again. Pretty nasty wounds, though, so he'll be out of action for a little bit. All XCOM operatives are secure. Firebrand is returning to base. Status confirmed. Mission accomplished. This time it's Marty. Do Everyone is doing these amazing poses. I love them so much. Like, I feel like the whole team has gotten together and, like, we are going to do the most glamour poses that we can. If it improves morale, then I suppose there is no harm in it. The speaker commended loyal citizens today for standing up to those who would abandon our values for those of the old world. The remarks followed a moment of silence. Okay. We got a few more promotions Morale to do. Is sure to be high after an operation like that. Great work, Commander. And modular weapons is going to be done in four hours, so we'll be able to start putting some mods on our weapons. All right, 26 days. I'm so sorry, Marty. You're going to be out for a while. But in the meantime, we'll go ahead and promote you with Walkfire. You're a hero, my friend. Take the rest. You've earned it. Chicken Boo. Grab center mass for extra damage. Okay, let's see here. Whizzical, high mobility, above average aim. Vitriol, 15 mobility, lower than average aim. I think Vitriol is going to be our rocket spe or specialist. So we're going to go ahead and go to technical. And you are specifically going to be all about those rockets. Trench warfare is not bad. And hail of bullets is pretty good too. A guaranteed hit is always a good thing. Now, I know a lot of people, like, rag on Concussion Rocket, but it's basically a long-range flashbang. It's pretty great. It can do stuns. So I'm actually going to take it. Um, we'll go ahead and take Biggest Booms, Tandem Warheads, Javelin Rockets, Salvo. I might even take Bunker Buster, which is the one that really destroys lots and lots of cover. Yeah, I think that's going to be the way to go with this particular soldier. Okay, we've got 
Whizzical. What do we not have two of yet? We don't have two rangers, gunners, or assaults. I think with 68 aim, making him into an up-close and personal assault is probably the way to go. So we'll get a shotgun and a stunner. Combat fitness is going to increase that aim and give him a little bit more mobility, which is nice. Coup de Gras is also amazing, but his combat intelligence is very low, so it's unlikely that we're going to end up getting both of these. Close and personal, killer instinct, extra conditioning, rapid fire, untouchable, and probably lethal. If I'm going to be doing rapid fire, then lethal's probably the way to go. Finally, we've got Robin. I need another gunner and another ranger. I think we're going to make you a gunner, and we're probably going to have you doing lockdown as your main thing. Although... Yeah, I think, I think we're going to go gunner. Lockdown. Mayhem. I feel like Chain Shot is better than Demolition. But with her aim the way it is, I think it's probably still a good a good thing to do. We'll do Cool Under Pressure. Rupture is always useful. And then I think Combat Fitness will help us get a little bit more aim and a little bit more mobility. We'll go Ever Vigilant, since we already seem to be doing a bunch of Reaction Fire stuff. That's probably it. Okay, other than Marty, who is seriously wounded, everyone else is good to go. We're just about to finish Modular Weapons. And we get a Soldier. But we need to get our next few missions first. So we're going to scan here, and this will be... Avenger no, that's not what I meant. Course. It's fine. I just lost a couple hours going back and forth. Not a big deal. It expires in nine days, so I've got, I've got some time. Setting course for Sector 2, Australia. The outcome of this research can only further our advances, Commander. Ooh, experimental weapons inspired. Which means it only takes two days to get done. I don't have a proving ground to actually make the weapons, but I may as well take advantage of the inspiration. The science is eager to begin, Commander. And now that I have modular weapons... We're going to grab Tammy. We're going to give you a regular sniper rifle. We're going to put a stock on it, which is very important. We'll give you an expanded magazine so you've got more bullets. And we'll give you a laser sight to get you more crits. Chaco Sunshine, for the time being, you can have the Marksman Rifle. There we go. And I did just say that... Robin is going to be a lot about reaction fire. 
So I'll go ahead and give her a hair trigger and a stock as well to get a little bit of extra aim going. Not bad. Okay. Continuing to scan, looking for our next missions. Eleven days on a smash and grab, which is amazing. Absolutely amazing. We're definitely doing this. Now, we gotta be careful because each character has willpower. And the lower that willpower is, the more likely I am to get tired at the end of the... at the end of the mission. I don't think we need, like, the A-team, though. So, with the smash and grabs, I kind of want speed. I want people who are fast. So we'll go ahead and grab Nick. We'll grab Grunt and Hat Guy. A uh, Hat Guy for the moment, no, Grunt for the moment is gonna grab the Old World Assault Rifle. Who else? We'll bring Pun Queen along. I don't know that I need two Shinobi in one fight. We'll bring Grant. And then probably some rookies. Chrissy's got good aim. But I want to save some people for possible psionics later on. So I'm not going... I'll go ahead and take Chrissy along. But I think I'm going to save the rest of my rookies for potential psionics later on. Bring Chaco Sunshine, and that should be more than enough. And just so many grenades for Grant. So many grenades. Okay, that should be good. Yeah, I think that is plenty. Any other weapon upgrades I want to do before we go? No, I think we're pretty much okay. Sky Ranger, do we're in the pipe. Five by five. Our inspiration did prove beneficial. Experimental weapons are done, nice and quick. So we will have to go ahead and do a proving ground as soon as we can. Hybrid materials would be really nice, except that I need the alloys, which I don't have. So for the moment, we'll go ahead and do the trooper autopsy. Knowing that my past surgical experience is limited, I am sure the crew appreciates that I hone my skills on fallen Advent forces before triaging our own wounded. Gross. To the uninitiated, the common Advent trooper is seemingly human. The aliens have disguised this most glaring divergence from the human form with a carefully designed helmet. Don't like that. Okay, seven days to get the trooper autopsy done. Let's start clearing out the next room. We don't have the supplies yet to do anything.
Wow. Two days? Are you kidding me? Okay, I don't think this is gonna happen. Commander, I'm getting faint traces of a signal. Yeah, even with a boost. Someone on the ground is trying to reach us, but I can't make it out. Keep your eyes peeled for possible contacts down there. How long do I have left? Five days on that. Avenger, We're just gonna take a course. glance at the black market really quick, see if there's anything that they really want from us. Market is open. No, not really anything I feel like selling. And I don't really have the supplies to buy anything worthwhile. Avenger plotting new course. We'll go ahead and pick up this soldier. It's a gunner. Setting course for the Australian sector. So the moment that this second liberation mission vanishes, it will pop up again in the country. So I want to make sure I'm scanning here all the time so that I can pick it up on a better timer next time. Another important step forward in our research. Despite a thorough analysis, I have yet to discover one, if any, advantage the advent no, hybrid I'm not spending 60 intel. eyes provide. Testing their visual acuity will no doubt prove difficult. Let's go ahead and de get the sectoid autopsy done, because I do want to jump into psionics as fast as possible. Though I was never witness to one myself, countless observers attest to the existence of a much smaller, less intimidating variant of the sectoid that took part in the original invasion. In the time since, this new being, the product of clear genetic manipulation, is now a familiar face to our forces operating in the field. You have got to learn how to do this more cleanly, Tygen. Stop getting blood all over your cameras. It's gross. Four days for a scientist. Wow, what is going on with all these really low timers? I think I'm going to have to boost this one, which is unfortunate. But this group looks pretty good overall. Go ahead and grab some AP rounds. Give one to her. And one to Dash. Okay, with seven to nine enemies, this should be fine. I do need that scientist. Let's go ahead and get that infiltration started. Sky and then I'm going to stick around until I see that liberation mission again. Got an urgent communication coming in for you now, Commander. I had high hopes for the resistance under your leadership, Commander, and you have outdone yourself. I don't know if I have. I feel like I have not been running enough missions for the first month, but here we go. We don't know where any of the Chosen are yet, so that's fine. Hopefully that means they don't know us either. And I don't see any dark events coming because, again, very, very brand new campaign. 
My people are up for some additional work if you've got any orders for us, Commander. Excavation speed increased or all resource from scanned rumors are doubled. I think excavation speed is going to be the thing. So we're going to go ahead and set that. This is what I meant when I said that I was setting the faction orders um, at the very beginning. Gives me a little bit of benefit here. We might take the elders by surprise if we switch up our tactics. Maybe we should try something new. I can gather intel here if I've got the people for it. Commander, at this point we've committed so many of our soldiers to conducting covert actions that we're running low on manpower for our own tactical operations. We'll need to recruit new forces if we're going to keep this up. Let's, let's make sure I've got enough to run the mission, though. Ready, ready, three, four. No, I don't have the people to both run the liberation mission when it comes back and do the covert, so we're not going to do it right now. Okay, the enemy readiness is normal on this, so what I might do is I might go ahead and over, over infiltrate a little bit, see if I can get this to vulnerable, which affects lots of things like how long my timer is, how big the enemy's detection radius is, like it affects a lot of things. So I think we're going to keep scanning for a little bit until we get to like 117%, now we're at vulnerable, we'll go ahead and get that... Um, get that mission going. We're looking to get some advent resources, hopefully get us some supplies, some other stuff. Um, but we're going to do that in the next video. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you then.